times our rack is not coming in on time and I kind of need to get that done. It's windy. Hold on. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Okay, since our rack is not coming in on time and I kind of... Since our rack is not coming in on time and I kind of need to get that done soon, I'm just going to go get one and then worry about getting reimbursed or returning the old one or whatever. I'll figure that out later, but I just need a rack to mount everything to, so I'm going to go get one. So I went to a place to get a rack to mount them in, but they don't have them. They have to order them, which is we have one on order already. So. I guess I have to drive to San Francisco on Friday and pick it up, bring it home, install everything real quick before work, go to work, and then in the morning take it down there. And hopefully everything is good. I kind of wanted more time to do it, but, you know. Mm. Oh well, I'll do what I can. So, Scott and I went flying with a friend named Ryan, and he was learning how to fly. But instead of having a good flight, this is the fuel tank. As you can see, it has been compressed and crushed and popped. Now apply that force to the rest of the airplane. Not the best day. The broken arrow is broken. Again. But it's fixable. Hey, this finally came off. That's the spinner. Flattened. Engine should be okay. Firewall should actually, for the first time ever, is okay. Oh, wow. We stabbed through the rubber on the uh, fuel tank mount there. <laughs> we just obliterated this. Okay, so it seems like engine forward okay. Fuel tank compartment and crumple zone destroyed rest of the plane okay so yeah how did this happen ryan flew it so what happened well ryan was flying went out and he made the plane go like this and then i thought okay you're way over banked you can't correct it so i'm going to take it and correct it but i thought the plane at the time was like this so i said roll 90 degrees to level and pull up but if the plane's this way, roll 90 degrees to level and pull up. Now we're in a very big or very bad situation, and we can't get out of it, and I couldn't figure out orientation. That. So, I guess your tip of the day, don't fly towards the sun at sunset, because then your plane's a big shadow no matter which way it's going. And that happens. Scott's at my house early so we can, well, you're super early for going tomorrow, but playing games. The Omni gear doesn't look like it would work very well. That's because there's also two Omni gear on the wings. <laughs>